Hey, welcome back to another Medication Minute. My name is James. I'm one of the clinical pharmacists here at Sentara Lee Hospital. Today we're going to talk about Rivaroxaban, or sometimes it's called by its brand name Xarelto. Rivaroxaban is an anticoagulant and it works by slowing down the clotting process in our, in our bodies, in the blood. Uh, which means that we're typically going to use it for diseases where there either already is a clot that's formed or a clot might form. So we're talking about atrial fibrillation, pulmonary emboli, deep vein thrombosis, DVTs, um, post-op for an, or, uh, an ortho procedure, uh, etc. It's a tablet, it's very easy to take. You take it by mouth, typically it's once a day. If we're using it to treat uh, or to prevent a blood clot in AFib, it's gonna be 20 milligrams once a day. But if we're using it to treat a clot that's already formed, it's gonna be 15 milligrams twice daily for the first 21 days, and then it's gonna go down to 20 milligrams once daily. So it depends on the indication, the way that we dose it. And that dose may change depending on the patient's renal function. Uh, because it's an anticoagulant, what we're looking out for with these medications is bleeding. Uh, I like to tell the patients to look out for either bleeding somewhere it's not supposed to be or normal bleeding that lasts too long. And then I'll give them some examples like bleeding somewhere it's not supposed to be either in your urine, you see it in your stool, when you're brushing your teeth, anything like that. Or normal bleeding, you cut yourself, you expect to bleed, but it, it keeps bleeding on for too long. If you see either one of those situations, you should let your physician know. One pearl that you can tell the patient is that this medication absorbs much better if it's taken with a meal. So try to schedule it around the time that you have a large meal, whether that's breakfast or dinner, whatever suits your schedule. Thank you so much for helping our patients understand what their medications are so that they can actively participate in their own care. Thank you guys. Please call pharmacy if you have any questions or concerns, if you need some help. And thank you for uh, helping us to be the medication stewards for our patients.